Unplug the main fog light harness connector. This connector is located along the driver's side frame rail, underneath the truck. Use a 15mm socket to remove the two bolts per side that secure the OEM bumper side supports. These bolts can be seen when looking into the wheel well towards the front of the truck. Save these bolts for reuse. Pull off the two plastic covers that sit around the tow hooks on the front of the bumper. There are no tools required for this step, they simply pull off by hand. Use an 11mm to remove the adaptive cruise control bracket mounting nuts. If your truck does not have adaptive cruise control, you may skip this step. Use an E6 external torque socket to remove the three adaptive cruise control bracket mounting studs. Unplug the adaptive cruise control module as you remove it. If your truck does not have adaptive cruise control, you may skip this step. Use an 18mm socket to remove the OEM bumper mounting bolts that became visible after removing the two plastic covers. There are four bolts per side. Remove the OEM bumper from the vehicle. Use an 18mm socket to remove the tow hook mounting bolts. There are four per side. Then remove the tow hooks from the vehicle. Use an 18mm socket to remove the mounting nuts for the lower brackets on each frame rail. Then remove these brackets from the vehicle. Save the bolts for reuse. If you purchase lights or a winch, now is a good time to install those on your bumper. Use the supplied universal light mount kit to install your light to our bumper, but use the manufacturer's guide for wiring information. Please follow the winch manufacturer's guide for mounting and wiring information. Remove the double nut clip from the OEM bumper. Then reinstall that clip on the slot coming off the forwardmost body mount. Do this on both sides. Install the supplied bumper mounting brackets on the vehicle. For the top two mounting holes, use the supplied half inch bolts, washers, and nuts. For the two mounting holes on each side, use the OEM hardware that was taken off previously. Then, for the mounting holes that sit against the newly installed nut clips, use another set of OEM bolts that was set aside previously. Install the supplied U-nuts into the mounting holes on your new bumper. Set the bumper in place in the vehicle, then loosely install the supplied 3 8 inch hex head bolts with washers from the back side of the bumper mounting brackets. Align the bumper so that it sits straight in relation to the grille and headlights and is centered left to right. Then go back and torque all the 3 8 mounting bolts to 25 foot-pounds. Stand back and enjoy your new Stealth Fighter front bumper. For any more technical information, or to browse our selection of products for all newer makes and models of trucks, visit our website at addoffroad.com.